The Fan Ling Golf Course, home to the Hong Kong Open, is one of the city's largest and oldest golf courses. The government plans to use part of the land to build housing units. The Hong Kong Golf Association hopes the authorities will change their mind as it fears the plan may lead more international events being taken away from Hong Kong by the city's competitors. Timothy Lee tells us more. Stretching for thousands of yards, the Hong Kong Golf Club, otherwise known as the Fanling Golf Course, is not only home to the Hong Kong Open Golf Tournament, a prestigious international competition that attracts top players from across the world. It also contains some of the city's richest biodiversity, crucially endangered trees and even tombs dating back to the Ming Dynasty more than 460 years ago. But the golf course may suffer serious damage as the government aims to reclaim the first eight holes of the club's old course to provide more housing. Seeking to preserve the integrity of the golf course, Asian Tour wrote to the town planning board in a bid to convince the government to change its mind. The letter said the tour does not exclude the possibility of relocating its future tournaments to other Asian countries if it deems the Fanling golf course as unsuitable. Asian Tour is the main men's professional golf tour organizer in Asia. Danny Lai, the chief executive officer of the Hong Kong Golf Association, believes the Asian Tour's letter presents a strong case and could possibly be the final chance for the government to pull back from taking the land. Other Asian countries are competing for mega events. Uh, such as, for example, Singapore. Uh, they have Asian Tour. Uh, European Tour hasn't been there for many years and they are talking about going back to Singapore next year. Uh, other amateur tournaments are also staged in Singapore in the past few months. So we are actually losing out to other Asian competitors. On the fact that the planned housing development would not encompass the entire course, Lai had this to say. The course has more than 100 years of history, which is the oldest golf course in Asia. Uh, I think everyone, every city in Asia, they want to have an over uh, a century old golf course in, in the city. Now we have one. I hope we don't destroy it. But Professor Carlos Lowe from the Chinese University's Department of Government and Public Administration said there isn't much the association could do if the government intends to use the golf course land. There's a conflict of interest between promoting sport and solving housing problems. I think it's very difficult to stop government from taking uh, the, uh, part of the land away for the public purposes. Uh, because public interest always overrides any considerations. The Hong Kong Golf Association urges the government to reconsider its land development plan on the club's premises in order not to strip the city the opportunity of hosting such world-class sporting events. Timothy Lee, TVB News.